What's up, YouTube? We're uh, Codename Reaction. And, uh, well, one, mm -hmm. let's just say thank you. We hit a thousand subscribers. Thank you very much. That, uh, That's saying something. That is a th 999 more than I expected. Uh, <laughs> well, what was our estimate? Like five years done? What we probably would hit a thousand? Oh, uh, yeah, I was, I was thinking a thousand about the time I retired, so 2065. Well, I was um, being very generous. Yeah. yeah. So you guys have uh, put us on the fast track. Mm -hmm. uh, with that, we have uh, decided to expand. Yes. And that's what this is. Mm -hmm. So welcome to the maiden voyage of Codename Reactions Metal Reviews. Which, you know, I hey. We, I thought we were doing pop reviews. We were doing pop reviews? Oh, fuck. No. Uh, no. No. There's absolutely no. No, no pop. We'll do pop. Yeah, there. they'll, they'll be pop right. later. <laughs> but we figured... We are so deep into the hip hop world, not really, but we no. were, we're, you guys are schooling the shit out of us and we're loving it. We're like, you know what? Let's give back to the community and, uh, let's school them in something. Let's go to home base here and be like, here's, here's our world. Yeah. So, uh, on this maiden review, yes. which you'll also know, notice we've color coded these. Yes. Mm, yes. Because so. we have free time and we thought it was cool. Um, I have a lot of free time on my hands. Mostly free time. Yeah. Uh, but uh, on this first review, uh, what are we doing, Skylar? We will be reviewing. Ooh. We should all. Uh, we didn't even introduce ourselves. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Skylar. I'm still go. Yeah. All right, cool. That's all the yeah, way. Yeah, that's all. Oh, the way. wait, wait, wait. And before we do that, <sighs> if you like what you see, like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel, down there, and then follow and us Twitter and here. Twitter right there. I, I don't know what to do with my hands, Ricky Bobby. Uh, <laughs> it, it, it's uh, you know, same old jargon. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. I mean, it's, 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 it's the same old song and dance on a different video with a little bit more distortion. Um, <laughs> I like what you did. <laughs> so what are we doing? We will be reviewing The Void by Parkway Drive. Which, uh, this album got a lot of heat. Like good heat or bad heat? Bad heat. Yeah, from what I've, I mean, I've dabbled with this album. This might be a little bit more reaction too because I, I haven't got, a, I've got around to it singly, but I haven't really dipped into the whole album, but this, I love this, Parkway Drive. This is definitely a, a review on my part, because mm -hmm. I actually, this is actually probably one of my top albums of the year. Really? Yeah. That is a high accolade. So, so all right, let's hop into this bad boy. All right. Uh, da, da, metal. Okay, so it's metal. Yep, definitely metal. Mm -hmm. All right, we got that out of the way. This is a hell of a lot softer than normal. A lot softer. You can definitely tell in the guitars it's not very chuggy metalcore like they used to be. Definitely blues. You can hear the blues. I was thinking Horn. like more like groove oriented, like mm. like Elstrom. Honestly, I'm gonna say this. It, it has a pirate I'm gonna metal say this. vibe to yeah, the track. A little pirate. bit. I don't think I don't hear it. I hear it. this is gonna be weird to say, and the metalheads are gonna be like, huh? Ah. Yeah. But just stick with me. I hear a ZZ Top influence, like a real bluesy, a very bluesy, like country mm -hmm. rockish. But even with the way he's doing the vocals and stuff like that, it's it's very ZZ Top. And it's more slime vocals than actual scream yeah. vocals that you know Parkway is known for. Yeah, yeah, he is definitely. I was waiting for him to come out and like rip our throats out and shit on our faces, but uh, he he brought us tea. Yeah, I mean I don't hate it. It's just okay. It's it's a different <laughs> gear change, and that's where most of the flat came from. It's like this is oh, not Parkway no Drive. No way. This, Wait, is, this is a metalcore. Oh my god, you're telling me that they didn't put out the same album twice? I know, right? Oh god, the the humanity of yeah. putting out a different album. It's got a different title. It's a different album. It's a different part of their life. People, if well, you want the same album over and over, put that that album on repeat. Go back to that album. <laughs> love it. Play yeah. it till you fucking hate it. That is a moment in time. That you can only access yeah. in that one point. So keep time. that moment of time and just back to the future it and just keep playing it over and over. Yeah, so basically, well, that's the thing about being in the band. There's, It's a double-edged sword. Yeah, you either people. stay the same, yeah. you get told, why don't you change it up a bit and actually you know, spread your creative mm -hmm. wings. Yeah, yeah. Or when you do change, like, oh, you're supposed to be this band, you're supposed to be under this subgenre, you need to sound like this. Moral of the story is if you're, if you're dealing with a mass audience, you'll never, ever make everybody happy. And as so, musicians... Day one, you, you <laughs> do got, what you want to do, make you happy. Musicians, day one, you practically sold out as is because you're selling your soul to, mm -hmm. to music as yeah. is. You're making mm -hmm. your life's passion. Yeah, that's how it is. Yeah. All right, let's get back into this yeah. easy top cover. I mean, Parkway Drive. <laughs> So 
still here in Jizzy Town. And I'm here in Yellowstone. Fair. Oh, I just, I, I, I hate the fact that I just like paused it right before it was gonna go back into it. Mm -hmm. But can't you just like envision yourself just on a ship drinking rum, just like swaying back and forth to this riff? Mm -hmm. I can see no? myself with a very long beard and uh, a really fast car. That too. That also yeah. works. I That's guess the top side of it. I'm seeing. So you're seeing that. I'm just going like, let's just go all fictional and just like. <laughs> Yeah, I'm seeing like an old so, hot yeah. rod and some chick scantily clad in a passenger seat, and me just rocking out. Yeah, so I went down the different path. <laughs> okay, let's get back into this. <laughs> Although. Hmm. His, his, his vocal delivery? Yeah, the execution? It's very A7X. Mm, to an extent, it's very, like, like we said before, some, uh, it's more slam-oriented yeah, yeah. than screams. Uh, although he brings the screams back a little bit in the chorus. Yeah, I bet it's a little, it's, a, it's, it's like a mixture between A7X and mm -hmm. uh, um, uh, Death Punch. Uh, why would you say those two things? Well, actually, a lot of people because were saying that that's they, what it sounds they like. went down that route compared to their metalcore mm -hmm. you know, roots and everything mm -hmm. like that. And I'm like, a band has to evolve. They have to. That's fine. I mean, I don't... I, I'm, I'm all for bands. This album, mm -hmm. this album, this album. So, you know, yeah. That's great. I'm just... From what I'm getting from this, that's what I'm pulling is they're, they're kind of going a little... Uh, mainstream. Main, it's mainstream, they're, they're, fine. They're going a little mainstream. Whatever. Everybody wants to go mainstream at yeah. some point. But... I've, I've always liked this track on the album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, we talked over the solo. That's mm -hmm. probably a cardinal sin. Yeah, I'm sorry. I also fought the urge to pause during the solo, so that would have been two sins. Yeah. transition mm -hmm. you can't even argue that that was very a7x it was <laughs> uh, uh, it, okay yeah this this album they actually did go a little mainstream which is fine i'm this. just just say like if you i'm used to like parkway driveway so they were they were like they were a little hard, harder but this is still good this you're, is you're thinking like horizons parkway where yeah. they were just like blistering solos yeah, yeah, yeah. and everything yeah. like scream vocals which is fine people move on you know everybody mm -hmm. does their thing and a7x did the same thing when they came out with that uh, they did city of evil city of evil was their Re Lighter record. That yeah. was a re-image. Yeah, which is fine. I'm not worried about it. It's just like, that's what I'm pulling out of this mm -hmm. is this is like that. Yeah. Well, know? like, even like when you look at all the remains, like their last metal album, as you know, people say, was you no know, Fall of Ideals. Mm -hmm. Once they released Overcome, and then it's like downhill mainstream from there. I'm like, they actually got better. But yeah, they took some risks. Meh. Like, I think they covered a Garth Brooks song, which is interesting but no like every band has to evolve they yeah. can't just put out the same goddamn mm -hmm. album every every fucking two to three years well that and i mean honestly you get older and eventually you're just like your musical taste will evolve as you that get older. and 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 your your old body won't jump around and do blistering solos for an hour and a half anymore <laughs> i'm so surprised randy can do that on stage yeah it's yeah, yeah, yeah he's, he's outstanding nobody yeah. will tell you that though <laughs> all right let's finish this up So you gotta admit that song wanted to make you like just like chant and just like put your fist to the air. I know you kept getting the like driving down the highway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's a, it's a good tune, mm -hmm. but um, and I'm gonna probably get flack for this, but it's one. 
we didn't even cover the lyrics because there's not that many here. No, there's not. He's got like four lines mm -hmm. and they just go through the song. It's mostly an instrumental, which is fine, but and there's nothing really like it's all and sadly it's all cookie cutter metal mm -hmm. lyrics. Like he he like went to his phone and went da, 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 here's seven words and it was like yeah. mad libs. Which is fine. But the way I think it, I think he was trying to envision the void being an actual entity and that's in everyone's um I get it. I mean, there's no, a, in their psyche. There, so. I mean, it has a purpose, but and I'm gonna say something that's probably gonna get me some flack. But this kind of reminds me of like the Load Reload Metallica days. They're mm -hmm. good songs. Those albums are good. Over here, mm -hmm. and then the rest of their catalogs over here. Your like little side, your little side mission. Every band's discography has like yeah, which their is albums yeah. get split into different yeah. spectrums. You know, different eras and yeah. stuff like that. But that, that's what I'm kind of taking this as. It's like this is good stuff. But it's definitely um, an alternate reality parkway drive for me. You can definitely tell that they 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 have evolved. They yeah. have, they've stepped out of their comfort mm -hmm. zone, yeah. especially on their last album, Ire. They took a lot See, I of risk, Ire. and I, I loved, loved Ire, Ire as well. That was a great. And this album. is even lighter than Ire. Yeah, Ire was. But that's what I'm saying. Like, well, like, you know, they, it's good. They jumped off the cliff. They were like, we're taking some mm -hmm. risk with this. A lot of people liked Iron. Mm -hmm. A lot of people didn't. Um, but then they even went even further with this album, mm -hmm. as you you can clearly see. Yeah, and like, I and I have no problems with it. No. But I, uh, it's gonna take me a minute to, to, to get on the on the on the bus with this one, just because a different tonal shift. Yeah, basically, it's just gonna take me a little bit to kind of retool and be like, oh, now this is Parkway Drive. Mm -hmm. I still like this. It's just weird that you know, it's 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 it's, it's a horse of a different color. But yeah, basically, but yeah, well, nothing wrong with changing your horse color. Not every song and every album is for every it's fan. No sense. What you can't change a horse color. Never mind. No, <laughs> You and your fucking Wizard of Oz. Anybody, analogy. anybody who's spray painting horses, stop. That's not how you do it. It's, um, it's, I think that's a law, maybe. I'm pretty sure that's a law. But not in Arkansas. But uh. <laughs> but no, not not every song, not every mm -hmm. album is, is meant for everyone. Yeah. So no, it's fine. I guess this is their. Um, this is their. This is definitely their mainstream album. This I, is where they I wouldn't even say lives. mainstream. This is their. Um, this is us now album. Like every, you know. I can definitely, I can, if I can remember correctly, in their documentary of behind the scenes footage that they were releasing, a lot of the riffs that they were writing, they mentioned that you no, know, they were they're catchy. A lot of the riffs <laughs> that they, like in this song, they're catchy. They mm -hmm. make you want to like bob your mm -hmm. head and like actually headbang and whatnot. As far as vocal content, there's not much yeah, there. Yeah. I mean, but, honestly, this this song comes across to be as a A Seven X cover in ZZ Top. Which is a weird yeah, type of but it works. analogy. But but no. Like I said, this is actually on my album of the year list. Mm -hmm. Um obviously you need well, to take some liking to it. I mean it'll pop up and I'll put it on the list, but I I just like I like Iron more. Yeah. I like my Parkway Drive uh gritty and brutal. This is more uh No, you wanna go back to Horizons mm -hmm. Parkway. Well, I like Iron Iron's probably my favorite album, but I, I like like to do the analogy right, I like my Parkway Drive in jeans and a T-shirt. This is more of a three-piece suit. Uh, Parkway Drive. <laughs> you could play this at a dinner party. Let's be honest. <laughs> That'll be weird, but uh, yeah, that that'll just be weird. I I can't really picture that happening. <laughs> so, but no, that is our review. review for the boy by Parkway Drive. Yeah. Until next time, guys. See you then.